Uh, M0 FXB. M0 FXB. Just gonna have a little play with APRS on the FTM 300. I've already put in um, 144800 as my as a memory channel, and some have programmed 144825 for the ISS. So I've I've put that in as well. There. So there's actually two menus on here for APRS. One is uh, hold down the disp and uh, no, hold down the function. Go to APRS, select. And then you've got a nice long list here. Um, so I haven't really touched any of them. The message text, I have selected that, and then you can put in a message. The modem is on, you can toggle on and off. The mute is so you don't listen to all the, the sounds, but I leave that off because I, I do like the sound coming in. APRS pop-ups, yeah. That's how long you want to see them appear on the screen. APS ringer. They're all on back. It's a notification sound if I'm right. That delay part is to do with um, satellites, I think. Go back. Yeah, so this is your your distance and speed altitude. I haven't programmed anything in yet. There's that one. Some text, I put something in there on number one. Digipath against, I think that was to do with satellites. My call sign's in there. I've put in dash nine for now. Messages that you can store and pre stored messages. Message replies. And my position, which is on manual at the moment. I'm not really getting a fix. That's one I put in the other day. It's not exact. Symbol, you can choose the symbol if you're a car or caravan. Position comment as well, off duty. There you go. The main thing is I think is turn the modem on. Uh, which we have as on there, so back. Now there is another menu, if you just hit the F briefly, APRS, if you select STN list, you can see all the ones you've had come in. I've had nothing come in at the moment because it's not on an external antenna yet. And messages as well. And you can actually beacon TX. And it will quit, it's United just quickly transmitted um, to my other radio. Just to let you know it does work. And what we'll do is we'll try and transmit the other way in a second. Um, right. Um, so there is another thing where you can tell it whether you want APRS on A or B. Or receive on A and transmit on B. You can actually do that. So... Hold down the button, F button, turn to data, select the with the knob, and then data band select, and look, you can select there, B band. See that? You've got A, A, T, X to B, and things like that. It's quite neat little options. So... We'll leave it where it started and maybe have a play with that another time. Let's go back. 
So basically, we're all set to transmit and receive. Well, I haven't turned on the uh, automatic transmit at the moment. Um, let's just key up on my FTM 400 and see if we get a packet come through. No, we're not, so I'm guessing that I haven't turned on the APRS um, function on the on the FTM 400. We'll come back. So yeah, on the 400, I forgot to put it onto beacon transmit. I pushed the F button and then we've got beacon TX there. So I'm going to touch that in a sec and it will transmit to the to the um, 300. We'll just get on here. We are receiving at the moment um, something on band A, which is my hotspot. But anyway, on band B, okay, okay. there goes the hotspot a minute. Let's turn that down. I wonder if we can get hotspot and um, APRS at the same time. So we'll hit beacon TX on my 400. And there you are. It's come through with everything I've told it to do. And it will hold that for 10 seconds. I wonder if we get the hotspot at the same time. Yeah, it looks like we do. So simultaneous receive of APRS and my hotspot. In this video, we're doing a TX to my FTM 400. So we're on the 300 now. We'll hit the F. We'll hit the select APRS function. Select that and see where it says beacon TX. We're going to select that in a sec, but I'll just move this over to the FTM 400, which is on APRS receive. We'll select the big knob on the beacon TX. I want it saying TX prohibited. So what have I done wrong? Standby. Yeah, so it did work. Um, so I just had to go on here. Select the F, APRS, which I select with the big knob. And again, I've already got it toggled to Beacon TX. I hit that. It transmits a beacon, we hope. Let's try again. It's funny, it did it just now. APRS function. Beacon TX, we'll hit that. Oh, it did do it, but it's possible that, because I've already received it, it's just put it in the list. So let's do the list. Because it did do it just now. So to do the list, we hit the F, and then we go to on the S list on the 400. And there we are at the top. There you go, M0 FXB, receiving APRS on the FTM 400, coming from the FT 300.